Hi guys, welcome to another episode of The Beautiful You Show. Today I am coming to you with a quick video. I just wanted to share with you my face of the day. So this is my eyeshadow, um, my cheeks, my brows. And so let me share the products with you. I will start with my face first. I have moisturizer. Um, today I used the sample from Fresh. It is the Preserves Cream. I'm sorry, I didn't bring it with me. Um, I have everything else. So today the foundation I am using is Max Face and Body. Um, this is in the color C5. I think it would be equivalent to around the NC42 if you're in MAC. Um, medium dark would be close but I like this foundation we are experiencing a storm here and so you'll hear the winds it'll get really blustery um, and it's raining you can hear the rain outside so I wanted to wear waterproof makeup and so Mac face and body foundation this is a foundation I have and it's waterproof it does well and um, I also love to wear it during the summer when it is super hot and you're super sweaty. Over that, I have um, my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Natural in Medium Dark. So that's what it looks like. This is the cover. I like this, I put this all around after I do my uh, foundation. I let my foundation set and then I put the powder over. Um, what's next? On my eyes. I have, let me get this one out so I can show you the colors. Uh, so I made my own MAC palette. And then all over the eye I have, I'll show you, oops. What is this one? I'm looking at it as I'm trying to tell you. Okay, let's get through with that. So, this is the MAC palette I made. You can buy these inserts separate. Um, this one I just left blank because I figured there's no need for an insert. And sometimes I'll put um, a highlighter there or sometimes I will put other uh, eyeshadows. So all over my eyes I have vanilla and then I have soba. Um, this one is bamboo. I also have texture. And then in the crease area, I have saddle and foley. To darken it up, I have, this one is handwritten. So it's my favorite deeper brown that's not black, but it kind of has the same effect. So those are the eyeshadows that I have in the crease and all over. And then on my lid, I have what is fast becoming my favorite eye palette ever. I have Guilt Trip from Pat, Pat McGrath, and I also have um, Bronze Struck. And so those are on the lid and over. This palette and the quality of these shadows are amazing. I, um, I want to get more Pat McGrath things. I'm trying to justify it. I don't need any more, but I want to get them. Uh, on my cheeks, so as my bronzer today, I have Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. I have never bought, is it upside down? I have never bought a full size of this. I used 100 points, um, and that's how I just keep getting the sample size, but it smells smells like chocolate like as if you put hot chocolate on the skin so I have it as my bronzer and up here my blush today is max Melba and I'll show it to you so I have that as my blush my highlighter today I used my favorite Bobbi Brown um, oh, a shimmer brick in bronze this thing i've had for years sorry the wind is blowing it's a very blustery um 
I again I said it in a past video I've had the shimmer brick for years I think it was $35 at the time that I bought it uh, from Neiman Marcus and now it's like $55 but it's so worth it I use it all the time I use it over here in the middle on top of my cheeks uh, through the middle of my face on my cupid's bowl and all the way down here under my eye I have a MAC um, MAC concealer it is the which concealer is it I forget which concealer it is but I use bare minerals mineral veil to set it on my lips I have max chestnut lip pencil and then I have whisper it's by nude stick and those two together they go so well it looks so nice um the new stick mutes the mac chestnut pencil and then on my eyelashes i have lancome's hypnose drama if you want to look like you have long um nice strong lashes this mascara is really good at doing that. I'll show you how the brush looks. So it's a little bit curved and it gets right in there and it doesn't clump them up. I love it. I usually always wait for a Christmas set. On my waterline, I have uh, Estee Lauder Burgundy Suede. This is the double wear stay in place pencil. This is like my third one. I just keep repurchasing this color and I absolutely love it. Um, it's so good. On my brows, I have Max Dip Down. I don't know if you could see that. Um, and I used it with a 266 angle brush. Oh, I forgot to say that after my uh, moisturizer, I put my Milk Blur Stick. I put this all around to help fill in some of the creases, to help fill in some of the spaces and create a smoother canvas. But that's it. That's my face of the day. Um, so I told you about my eyeshadow. I told you my foundation, my blush, my highlighter, my bronzer, what's on my lips. And that's it for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Ooh, it's getting even blustier. Wow. So the wind is really strong. We had a hurricane watch like maybe two weeks ago and supposedly it had passed us by turning into a tropical storm. I'll say that this is even stronger. We didn't have winds like this uh, two weeks ago. Two weeks ago we had maybe a couple gusts of wind but it's been doing this for the past couple hours. It's really strong, so stay safe. I know there is Hurricane, I think, Florence, supposed to hit the East Coast, so stay safe, guys. Uh, beauty is all around you. Thank you for joining me, and I will catch you guys next week. Thank you.